Scorpio. Big Scorp, Scorp in the building. What up, Scorps? How y'all doing? It's your girl here, Miss Hawaii. I'm coming at you to give you a general love reading for August 20th, 2021. Oh, no, Scorps. Oh, no. You know why I said oh, no? Because summer's almost up. Hope y'all got all y'all vacations in. If not, y'all still got some time. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Scorpios? I didn't set up the background for y'all, so I'm about to do my new Scorpio video. I want to make sure I got the background right for my Scorps. You heard? How y'all doing, Scorps? I've been horny lately, Scorpio. I think y'all been horny too. Mm -hmm. Let me know in the comments if y'all been horny, Scorpio, because I feel like, woo, yeah. I watched some horn this morning. I was like, oh, I miss sex. Oh, I miss doing all that and that and that. And that, oh, and this. Uh, so I said, yeah, my Scorpios ain't horny. Mm -hmm. Y'all horny, it's hitting y'all. You know we rule the organs, sexual organs. So, hey, hey. But anyway, Scorpios, it's good to see you guys. If you haven't subscribed to my other channel yet, make sure you do. It's called Miss Hawaii Scorpios. It's a channel for you, by you. All right, I have the link in the description box. Make sure you guys show love. I know a lot of you have already subscribed on it. But make sure you do, all right? And of course, subscribe on here. Like and comment. I love to hear what my Scorpio's got to say. All right, Scorp, make sure you go ahead and leave me a comment. I love talking to y'all. Now, you know if this reading resonates, there's going to be an extended reading link in the description box below, Scorp. If it sounds like I'm speaking to your heart, speaking to your soul, go ahead and meet me over on Vimeo, okay? The link is in the description box for the extended. For those who are not familiar in the extended readings, I pull your person's cards. I focus primarily on them, get their energy, and let you know what actions they'll be taking moving forward towards you. And we'll also look at advice from the universe, okay, regarding this person, Scorpio. So shout out to all my Scorpios who show love every week and purchase the extended. I love you guys. And um, I hope to see you guys in the extended. If not, I'm happy that you're here. All right. Personal reading, Scorpios. They're 30% off. 30% off until October 1st. Yeah, you heard right. 30% off personal readings with your girl. So make sure you guys get your personal readings while they're hot. All right. You can email Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. That is Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com the wait time is one to two weeks if you need the reading expedited do i have my oh no i don't you can pay an expedited fee i'll get you the reading delivered to you within 24 hours hold on score let me grab my computer charger i don't want my computer to die i got the music playing for y'all you heard Yes, Scorp. So get your personal reading while it's hot. Uh, Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. All right. I look forward to hearing from y'all. I love doing personal reads for my Scorpios. I feel like I connect to y'all, you know, really, really well. Especially having so much Scorpio in my chart. You know what I mean? That's why I'm able to really read Scorpio so well and connect with y'all. So email me, Scorp, 30% off. I mean, you can't beat that. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Uh, what else I want to say to y'all? Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Miss Hawaii Tarot on Instagram. That's for everybody who say, you drink too much Coca-Cola. I'm drinking water now, bitch. Now what you got to say? You're drinking too much water. Shut up, bitch. Putting up them, them, the, putting up these uh, decorations took a lot of work out of me. I'm getting old. <laughs> Had to stand up on the ladder and shit. But anyway, yeah. Um, follow me on Instagram, Miss Hawaii Tarot on Instagram. That is Miss Hawaii Tarot on Instagram. There's also a Facebook link for Miss Hawaii Tarot in the description box. If you have Facebook, please go ahead and like that page. Show me love on Facebook as well. Miss Hawaii Tarot on Instagram, Scorps. I look forward to seeing y'all. Okay, don't forget this is a positive only zone. I don't have to say that to Scorpios because y'all don't never bother me. Y'all don't never come on here talking reckless, but for the cross watchers, positive only. If it doesn't resonate, then it ain't for you. Go on to the next reader. Don't get offended. Not for you. All right. Um, Scorpios, if you're not a member yet, click that join button. Click that join button below. You get access to different readings. 
that are not publicly published, okay, on YouTube. They are private readings only my members can see. So if my readings resonate, you definitely should be a member. Or if you've been watching me for a while, Scorp, you definitely should be a member, all right? And shout out to all my Scorpion members. Thank you guys for supporting me. What popped out? Oh, the three of coins. Y'all get into the bread. Some of my Scorpios, you either got a new job offer coming in or your money, you stacking money right now. You focus on your fucking coins. I fucks with it. So, Scorp, let's see. We're going to pull four cards for you, and then we'll pull four cards for your person. All right? How does Scorpio feel in love, spirit? Thank you for clearing guided reading today for all my Scorpions. My sexy Scorpions. It's almost Scorpion season. We almost there. We almost there, Scorp. I'm going to do something special, too, around Scorpion season. Y'all know my birthday is on Halloween. Mm -hmm. Make sure y'all send me in some nice gifts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fucking with y'all. What's that? The Eight of Cups in reverse. Oh, Scorpio, who you can't walk away from? Oh, suka, 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 nah. Oh, we got two cards that came out. The Two of Cups in reverse and the Ace of Swords. Somebody you're not talking to. <laughs> Somebody you broke up with, you separated from, is on your mind. The five of cups, didn't I say it? You think about somebody, Scorpio, from your past. You think about somebody, there's a lot of disappointment, sadness here. Bottom of the deck is a six of pentacles in reverse. Could be a situation where you were giving to it and they weren't, they weren't meeting you halfway. They weren't putting in the effort that Scorpio was putting in in this connection. Um, this is somebody you definitely has a, have a lot of passion for. Possibly you want to fuck. I've been thinking about making love too. I was talking about sex earlier. Um, to somebody you're separated from, somebody you're not currently with, or you're having a disconnect with. I'm seeing either a breakdown in communication, like there's no communication, or the communication is real limited, barely any and i'm just seeing a scorpio that's kind of sad right now with the five of cups that's about disappointment sadness regret pain tears let's see a person the nine of cups oh this person is thinking about how happy scorpio makes them a lot of memories reminiscing about you fantasizing about you the fool oh shit could be an aries for some of y'all aries energy with that fool card this person is thinking about how they want a new beginning with you. Wow, Scorpio. How they want to take a leap of faith with you. The, oh, the Knight of Cups. Oh, shit. Scorpio, an offer, a love offer. Oh, my God. Somebody thinking about coming towards you, Scorpio. Woo, Jesus. It could be another um, Scorpio or a Cancer or a Pisces. The temperance card in reverse, Sagittarian energy, bottom of the deck. We got the queen of cups. Hey, hey, that's Scorpio. That's you, Scorp. Wow, you all up in here. You all up in here. What's behind you? The nine of coins in reverse. Ooh, some of y'all working too much, Scorpio. Watch out for being materialistic. Watch out for letting material things make you happy. Okay, I know money is great. Trust me. But um, don't try to let it replace no happiness for you, Scorp. <sighs> Let's go ahead and clarify this bitch. Oh my God, everything you need is tell me you still need more so now. I'm swerving. Huh. That's the interesting song that's playing. Songs have messages for it. Never thought we'd end up this way. Can we can't sleep. That it would come my day. You don't love me. You don't care. I'd be turning over. You won't be there. Gone. Can't believe he gone. Now I'm all alone. We must have made a wrong turn somewhere. He say. She say. Say. This is a song about a breakup, Scorpio. It's called Cruise Control by Kid Ink. Wow. So somebody is 
stressed out because they love you, because they care about you. They want to talk to you. And I see you got the same energy. You're in an energy of thinking about the cups that were spilled. Six of Pentacles and how you want to give to this. Your money looks good, by the way, Scorpio. Let's see the Eight of Cups in reverse. I just don't want some of y'all to just keep, you know, thinking, replacing money with love. The Ace of Wands. Yeah, you still have a lot of passion. Wasn't I talking about that horniness earlier? You still got a lot of passion for this person. A lot of fire. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You are very dedicated to this person. Very loyal. You saw a long term here with this person. The Knight of Wands. Ooh, could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Scorpio, are you getting any sleep at night? Nine of Swords. Are you having sleepless nights thinking about this person? You've been thinking about this a lot. Oh, Six of Cups. Didn't I say it? I told you. I read Scorpio so well. Other signs, I'd be like, the Knight of Cups. I don't be knowing sometimes. <laughs> but with Scorpio, your shit just flows. I guess because I have so much Scorpio in my chart. Six of Cups. This is somebody you were with in a past life. That's why you can't walk away from them. You can't leave them. You try. You, we Scorpios. I mean, it's easy for us to cut people off. We cut people off in an instant. It ain't nothing. But I feel like for a lot of Scorpios, this person, you cannot shake them. And you don't get it. For some of y'all, this is somebody from a while ago. And you're like, damn, I'm still thinking about memories. I'm still thinking about when we had that conversation about this, this, and that. Wow, Scorp, this is deep right here. I'm getting ready for this one. Show me the two of cups in reverse. Four swords popped out. It took you a lot to recover from this person, recover from this breakup, recover from this connection. Some of you actually felt like you died. Had to come back to life. You really had to take a break after this person. <laughs> it was a lot. It took a lot out of you. You healed though, but the six of wands. Yeah, this is a this is a connection that you really wanted to. You wanted this to work so bad. You wanted this to work so bad. And you're thinking about reasons as to why it didn't work. Was it me? Ten of Swords. Ooh, it was painful. Was it me? Was it them? How do I avoid something like this again? The Hierophant. You feel spiritually connected to this person. Could be a Taurus. You've been watching tower readings a lot about this person. Consulting psychics. Praying. Meditating. Some of you guys, this is somebody that's in the public eye with that Six of Wands card. Could be a celebrity. Somebody famous. Somebody a lot of people know. Or somebody a lot of people want. Some of you guys, there was a bad argument here between you and them. With that Ace of Swords in reverse. Scorpio could have let that stinger out. Said some horrible things towards this person. Because you was mad. You were hurt. You were angry. Person could have said some things to you. Knight of Swords in reverse. For some of you, whatever this big argument was. Fight could have been the reason why you left or this person left. Some of y'all are dealing with an, an air sign. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Five of Cups again. Scorpio, you're sad that you're not talking to this person. Or you're sad that this that this happened between you and this person. Because this is somebody you saw long-term with. With the magician in reverse, this person could have did something manipulative. They could have did something horrible, said some mean things to you. But you still love them. You don't get it. Anybody else, you would have cut them the fuck off. They mother, they grandmama, they papa. But this person, you can't shake them. You just can't. This actually goes with the soulmate reading. Some of y'all need to look at that soulmate reading I did a couple days ago for y'all, Scorp. High Priestess in reverse. Could have been a lot of secrets with this person. I'm seeing withdrawal. Some of y'all withdrew from this person. You're sad as fuck. The Five of Cups is here twice from two different tarot decks. You love this person deeply, Scorpio. Deeply. And Ten of Pentacles. I mean, your money look good. You, you know, you're, you're doing it by yourself. But you would much rather be with somebody else and have your Ten of Pentacles. You would much rather. You guard it towards everybody else. 
You don't trust nobody. It's hard for you to even let anybody new in. You don't trust nobody. You don't trust what they say. You don't believe them. With this person, it just felt so right. Yep, didn't I say it? Seven of Cups in reverse. You got options, Scorpio. There's a lot of people that want you. But Scorpio like, so? <laughs> they want me, so? That don't mean shit. You wanting me don't mean shit. Six of Swords popped out. You were forced to move on from this person. It hurt. Like, I can literally feel my heart, like, going like this, like. Felt so connected here to this person. This shit took a pop. This took, this took a chunk out of you, Scorpio. This took a chunk out of you. There it is again, the Six of Cups. And you keep thinking about the memories. You keep thinking about this person. This person could have even said some mean things to you. They could have even been verbally abusive, mentally abusive. That doesn't stop anything. Two of Cups with the Wheel of Fortune. You still feel like this, your soulmate, your twin flame, your destiny. You feel like it's destiny for y'all to come back together again. Six of Cups again. This is a past life soulmate. Show me the Knight of Swords in reverse. I feel like that's y'all. I feel like there's people trying to build with y'all, but y'all ain't fucking with nobody. just keep you know Scorpio it's hard for us because it's like when we attach ourselves to somebody we're not like a lot of other people that could just next day they with somebody else laying in the bed with the next person or you know can jump from person to person like when Scorpio gives you our, when we give you our soul man when we give you our soul we don't do that with everybody fucking is one thing Liking is another, but your soul connects with somebody, Scorpio. And that's what I'm getting with the two of cups and the six of cups. Your soul is connected to this person. And you go about your daily life and, you know, everything is fine. You look fine to other people, but inside, you're torn up. This is confusing to you. You don't understand how you can feel so deeply about somebody and it... And it and shit literally went down the way it did. It's confusing to you. Show me the nine of cups. Let's see your person now. The strength card. Could be a Leo. The three of pentacles. Some of y'all, this person is in another relationship. And they realize how happy you make them. Some of you, if they're in another relationship, they're with somebody that only wants them for their money or somebody that wants them for the wrong reasons. This person is very disappointed, very unhappy in love. If they're single, they're still unhappy. They could be holding back with a strength card. Why? Stop. Show me the Knight of Cups in reverse. Wow. They see you, Scorpio. They see you, you know, you, you definitely upgraded since the last time you fucked with them. Your money look good. They also see you as the queen of swords, though. They're very sad. A lot of disappointment as well on this person's end. You make them so happy and they, they think about you a lot, too. But this person isn't following their heart. They're holding back with that strength card. Some of you, they, they, they do the same thing you do. They go to work, hoping that, you know, work. They try to use work as a distraction to stop thinking about you. Show me the fool. Doesn't work. That's you again, the nine of pentacles. This person feel like you're doing good without them. 
They know they ain't get, they ain't do right by you in the past with the Six of Pentacles in reverse. They know they didn't equally give to this connection. This person knows they were even mean to you. But now, Eight of Pentacles. But see, there you go, Queen of Cups in reverse. This person is not sure if you even still love them anymore because of the way they treated you. Because all the time has passed. It makes them very unhappy. Nine of Cups in reverse. The thought of you not loving them anymore and moving on crushes this person. King of Swords in reverse. But they're not telling you shit, are they, Scorpio? Are they even talking to you? This could all be happening behind the scenes. Person tries to front like everything is okay, I'm getting. This person wants a new beginning from, the, from how mean they were to you. King of Swords in reverse. This person was, was, could have been very mentally abusive. They could have tried to break you down, Scorpio. They don't, they don't feel like they're that person anymore, though. They're not that person anymore, they're, they're, they're saying. I don't know if this is somebody you dealt with. They were very immature when you dealt with them. Show me the Knight of Cups. Whoa. What popped out here? Five. Oh. Wow. Yeah, they, um, <laughs> whoever this is, they either going to make you an offer if they haven't already. They love, what they really, really loved about you, Scorpio, is your love for love. How romantic you are, how charming you are, how full of emotions you are. Even though some Scorpios feel like they hate that about themselves. See, Ten of Pentacles. And that's what makes this person feel like they can have long term with you. Marriage, kids. They feel like y'all can y'all can be a power couple. Y'all can build a kingdom together. Three of Cups in reverse. Tower. They got some people around them that's jealous of y'all. For some of you, there's there's people around them. Friends, family that doesn't want them to go back to you, doesn't want them to be with you. They're jealous. They, they're talking a lot of shit. Maybe they've talked to this person about, you know, I'm thinking about Scorpio and the Hierophant. Again, this is one of the cards that flew out. A spiritual connection. Could be a Taurus, Scorpio, another Scorpio. They're planning, though, with the Two of Wands. How are they going to make this offer towards you? How are they going to come towards you? How are they going to make this work? They could also be watching tower readings, going to psychics, consulting, maybe praying, maybe even going to a priest, a pastor, priest. There's, there's, there's people around them, friends or family that's jealous, that don't want, they, they're trying to stop this person. That's for a very few of you, Scorpio. They're trying to stop this person from following their heart, which is coming towards you. And they, and they could be using that. See, the Knight of Cups again. From two different decks. This person is going to approach you. They are planning to come towards you. Uh, the Knight of Cups is about emote. And a, that's a messenger. Right now, I don't think y'all are talking with the Ace of Swords in reverse again. But whoever these friends are, that they think are friends or family members that are trying to keep this person from you. They're telling them, don't forget what Scorpio did. Don't forget what Scorpio said. Don't forget what happened. And this person is like, but I'm not happy. The last time I had happiness was Scorpio. Some of y'all, this person is drinking. Justice in reverse. It's like they have no peace until they make things right with you. Could be a Libra. They could be drinking, doing controlled substances. They're a wreck with that temperance in reverse. And it's like they're not going to be good until they make things right with you. Six of Pentacles. Didn't I say it? Until they balance out the scales with you. For some of you, they, they're going to want to offer you money. Offer you some type of gift. The Eight of Cups flipped over. Yeah. Some of y'all, this person walked away or you walked away. And it's like they haven't been the same since. This, this breakup, this separation with you, fucked them up for life. See, five of cups in reverse. Until they do right by you, Scorpio, everything they think about is going to fail. Didn't I say it? Yep. 
with the high priestess in reverse. They've been blocking out their intuition for a long time about this. And this person is really unhappy. They've, had, they've dated other people. Other people have come into their lives. Some of you, they've been engaged, married, serious relationships for some of you. And it just was nothing. It just didn't compare. They've never been happy. And they've never been happy like when they were happy with you. They've tried to replace Scorpio. They've tried to have other people come in. They, sometimes they even thought, you know, well, it's going to be somebody else. It's going to be somebody else. Scorpio is in it, and that didn't work. Five of Cups in reverse, that indicates they want to re they want to reconcile with you. They want peace. Four of Swords in reverse, they, they don't want no more of this silence period, this silent treatment. It's time to... to um. To step up. The Hierophant again with the tower. Yeah. Shit about to go down. Because they love you. And you love them. This person has always been in your heart. What's on the bottom here? Ten of Swords. Yeah, this was a, this was a painful breakup. Painful ending. You both are suffering in silence. Queen of Pentacles. And they see your money getting good. Hot Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Five of, yep. They scared. This person feel like they got bad luck. They got a lot of respect for you, Scorpio. They know your money is doing good. Your career is doing good. You're on a whole different level. Ring, ring playing by Cardi. Oh, you to make it ring, 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 ring. All your messages are coming through songs, Scorpio person miss you and you miss them is y'all y'all are mirroring each other Woo, jesus all right let's go into the extended if this reading resonated there's a link in the description box below that will take you over to the extended in the extended i'm gonna pull your person's cards all right gonna get to the bottom of this see how they feel about you see what actions they're gonna be taking moving forward towards you and we'll also get advice from the universe all right scorpio i love you guys this was intense this was heavy but we got this. I need y'all to stay strong. Please, Scorpio, stay strong. All right? Trust your angels. Trust the universe that everything is playing out the way they want it to. All right? I love you guys. I'll see you in the extended. If not, I'll see you tonight on Late Night to Row, 11 o'clock. Bye-bye.